Breaking news. Welcome to Lafree's Concept TV. Here is the headlines. Lagos belongs to all. Calls for Igbo to leave idiotic unfounded. Lagos belongs to all. Calls for Igbo to leave idiotic unfounded. To my dear listeners, before I go into details, ensure you like, subscribe and share. And now the details. Chief Body George, a prominent figure in the People's Democratic Party PDP, has criticized the recent demand by certain groups urging Igbo residents to leave Lagos. It dismissed the calls as arrant nonsense and sheer stupidity. Speaking during an interactive session with the media on the state of the nation at this Ekoi office, the retired army officer and Lagos indigenous expressed disbelief at the campaign, emphasizing the long-standing relationship between the Igbo community and Lagosians. It is nonsense. I say it is arrant nonsense. Why should we be saying that the Igbo people should leave? George questioned. He highlighted the deep-rooted connections between the Igbo and the people of Lagos. He recounted his experiences growing up with Igbo neighbors, playing football together and fostering a culture of inclusivity in the city. George also suggested that those advocating for the Igbo to leave Lagos are not true indigents of the state. I think those who are proposing or talking about it are not Lagos indigents themselves, he said. In Lagos, we welcome traders. Bring your wares, we look at it, we buy it. You make your money, we give you land to build. That is the culture of Lagos. The former deputy, national chairman of the PDP, further criticized these groups as people without genuine ties to Lagos. Those who are proposing this nonsense have no bearing, no family connection to Lagos, George insisted. I am saying it as a Lagosian. It is arrant stupidity. Why would you tell them to leave? They pay their taxes. George reminded the public of the significant contributions made by Igbo leaders, such as Dr. Onamdi Azikiwe, who was closely associated with Lagos political history through his relationship with Sir Abat Makoli. Why are you fighting them? Does it make sense? Lagos State was created in 1967. Since that time to now, the Igbo have had their contributions, he said. He also noted that those spreading such divisive sentiment are likely individuals from neighboring states, rather than true Lagosians. They should just shut up if they have a right to come here. Why are they blocking others? George asked. Recent social media campaigns, particularly around the time of the end bad governance of the end bad governance in Nigerian protest, are amplified these calls for the Igbo to leave Lagos. However, President Bola Ahmed Tinubu swiftly denounced such ethnic sentiment, stating in a national broadcast that there is no place for such divisiveness in Lagos. To my dear listeners, now I've come to the end of our today's news, and now before I go, in addition to the news I've read so far, 
I will categorically say as well that it is not it is not advisable to start to start advising ourselves to chase Igbos away from Lagos or any other southwest state. That means we are we are chanting for war. We are preparing for war. It doesn't make sense. It won't start like that. And it won't go well with us. Well, we start saying one um, one tribe should leave one tribe so that the other tribe can can live right. The question is, this tribe we want this tribe we are trying to chase away, are they are they our problems in this country? No. They are not our problems. Our leaders and we ourselves, we are our problem. We are our problem because even at some point, the problem should not have escalated to, to this extent. Not until when, they, when, when, when we people add, there will be an increment in, in social surprise. Then before you hear it, we ourselves would have added price just because of our gains. That is called selfish interest. And this selfish interest we are talking about is one of the problems we are having. We can't always put blames on our leaders, though they are the they, they, they masterminded everything and they are they, they are all behind every every um, situation we found ourselves. But we ourselves we are our problems too. Let's move down to the comment section before I continue. The first comment, first comment which I have says. The Igbos are ready to exit Nigeria to referendum, not just Southwest alone. So spare them your hypothetical statement. Another, this is another comment. And what I feel about this comment is that if the country is in the right position, if we have been treated right, would they have said they want to leave? No. Even the Obastula are also agitating. It's not just more rampant that the, than the way the Igbos people took it. Everybody wants to go to that part because it is not in this country does not does not even favor anybody. To my dear listeners, this country does not favor anybody. We are all just we are all we are all just trying. We are all we are all just trying. 